for my basketball career, it's so crazy because like this, and and he's he's like my brother. Like I give my basketball mostly career to like Steph. Mm-hmm. More of a because I remember like it's so crazy when we was in high school. The freshman year, I went to go to Caps, go to LaSalle Academy. Like I said, I was playing street ball. This is like my first year, really. Played like, at LaSalle with uh, Ron, Ron, Ron right? yeah, yeah, Ron's yeah. like my little brother. So like we we play. I come there. I come there in the eighth grade for a visit. So like I told you, I'm playing street ball. I ain't really play. So I go to watch a JV game. They don't have enough people. So we play. We play. Played against St. Anthony's. Bob Hurley. Right, right. Is the coach. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So. They're like, yo, we don't have enough people. So they're like, hey, do you want to play? I'm like, yeah, cool. I'm like, okay. Mind you, I'm in the eighth grade. It's 10th grade, JV. I'm like, yeah, I'll come play. Cool. So they're like, all right, we shoot up. play. And St. Anthony's supposed to be like this big thing. Powerhouse. But at this point, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know nothing about none of these high schools. I just know I am I know how to go one-on-one. I know dudes can't guard me. <laughs> Straight up. So I play. I have like, I think it was like 37. So Bar, Bar Hurley come over there. And he's like. Man, what grade are you at? You're in the 10th or 11th grade. And I'm like, nah, I'm in the 8th grade. And he's like, what? He's like, yo, you're going to be good. And then, so I'm like, oh, yeah, thanks. I mean, I'm just looking at him you right. know, like old Caucasian. Like, yeah, yeah, cool, whatever. So then um, he's talking to me. So then everybody's telling me who he is and what he does. I'm like, oh, okay. Well, I'm, I might <laughs> got a chance at this thing. So then this is when uh, Hoop Scoop used to come out, Street ah, Smith. Hoop, Hoop Scoop, Scoop. Yeah. that's a throwback. <laughs> so Street Smith. Smith. Hoop Scoop, though, so that's I a throwback. Go, so I go, and at this point, I just met Steph. Like, I just met Steph, Ray for Austin, mm-hmm. all these people, because I went to play with this team called Young Life. Thurman mm-hmm. player. He had all the best players in New York. Who did? Kareem Reed, Thurman player. Thurman. Yeah, that's yeah. My yeah, that's Thurman. Yeah, that's, 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 that's my guy. 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 So yeah. at this point, Thurman always had the best crew. Yeah. You know, that's why mm-hmm. he went from Young Life to Riverside. He had the best team. So he had all the like ballers. Like it was Kareem Reed, Rafe Austin, Stephon Marbury. It was like all these dudes. So everybody's like, yo, if you want to be good, you got to go play with Young Life. So I'm like, all right, cool. I'll go over there. i never forget Steph coming to the gym all the way from Brooklyn. You know, walking. At this point, he's walking like Kenny Anderson. Got the part <laughs> up the middle, this mm-hmm. and that. So I'm like, okay. And they're like, yo, he's the number one um, ninth grader in the country. I'm like... Like, hold on, I'm like, the country? I'm like, hold up. Like, the world? Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> you know, we young, so I'm like, the world? Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> so I'm like, the world? Right? So they like, yeah. I'm like, okay, cool. Serious like, shit. So now, yeah, so we playing against each other, and I'm like, okay, I'm holding my own. I'm like, okay. So then ninth grade, ninth grade come, beginning of the year, hoop scoop and all this stuff come out. But I don't know, like, you have to play tournaments to get in these things. So I'm looking in the, you know, they like, yo, the book is out. So I'm like, all right, cool. I'm like, let me look in the book, look in the book. He number one. I ain't nowhere. <laughs> I'm like, yo, hold on. I'm like, man, how you getting these books? And they're like, hey, you got to go to camps. This is, this is And then my school, Bill Abra, he was like the commissioner of five stars. So I knew I would go the next summer. Yeah. So I come the next summer, play, play against stuff. Now, mind you, I'm like, yeah, he, I'm like, he good. But I'm like, okay, I'm nice too. I'm like, he good. 10th grade come out. He's number one. I'm like, 144 in the city. <laughs> I'm like, yo, nah, this right here. I'm like, nah, I'm not I'm not 144 less. I'm like, right. no, we're not going to do that. And then from that day forth, like, man, start kicking it. I used to go to Brooklyn all the time with family, work out, talk back and forth. And then right after that, he was like, yo, I'm telling you, you just got to do, put in that work. This is not. Then like, from sophomore year on, I just shot up the charts. Like dudes that was ahead of me, just knocking them off, knocking them off, knocking them off, knocking them off, knocking them off to the point where then I became number two in the city, like the end of the junior year. And yeah. stuff. I used to be like, yo, I'm telling you. But like he used to fuel me because I, at one point, like people always wanted to make us rivalries, but they didn't know how much time we spent together. Mm-hmm. But he yeah, still fueled me because like, I was like, man, like he really like, he really killing, like he really, these people really love him. Then they start talking, like co- coaches used to always like talk about, at this point, I'm not even thinking about college, like coming from Brooklyn. 
Like, if they could make it out of Brooklyn, he right. could. I'm talking about college. I'm like, I'm seeing dudes getting left, smoked, killed, everything. And then the block I moved to was like the number one block for like murders in the 90s. Mm. So I'm like, bro, like if you like if you do anything with this basketball, you good. But then just by me being around him and his family, because his whole family played basketball. Yeah. Like nobody in my family Brothers played all basketball. Stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so I used to be around and God, you know, God bless his pops used to always talk to me, like, man, you're gonna be good. And then they was I was like, like they extra brother. Yeah. Extra the kid, yeah, you yeah know, no doubt. You know yeah, you know how it is, yeah. <laughs> so that kind of like pushed me and then like so I always give, give him props off that because at that point, even I tell people today, Steph is probably the best, best point guard I've ever seen play up close. To me, I think he's the best uh, New York point no, guard ever. Ever. Yeah, yeah. But I'm saying Steph is probably the best point guard I've seen ever. Mm -hmm. Like, it's dudes that nice and did more, but I'm talking about, I'm just talking about from every skill set. Yeah. Like dribbling, passing, shooting. And do everything. He never he never had any holes. And he had hops like a No, that's what I mean. He was like <laughs> athletic, point guard. He really knew how to play the point. He could shoot from yeah. he's like Steph is the first person I seen shooting from half in high school. Straight jumper. Yeah. Jumper. Not no, One step no, over no, half. And not no he. No, no, no. Not no Straight he. Straight jumper. Jump up in the air and land in the same spot. <laughs>